We're gonna talk about brows now. There are many different trends out there. The most important thing is that you pick the trends that actually work for your features. On Alyssa, we're going to apply a straighter shape to the brow. It's going to really frame her eye, her brow bone, and her face shape. I'm going to start with the perfectly defined long wear brow pencil. It's cut on a slant, just like an eyebrow brush, but make sure that you're focusing first on the areas of the brow that have less hair. When creating a straighter brow, you're not looking for as much of an arch. You're looking to level out the bottom edge of the brow. Then when you start to apply on the top part of the brow, you're looking for same straight edge, but not trying to create as much of a curve in the actual shape. As you can see, I'm starting where Alyssa has fewer hairs, and I'm actually working backwards against the grain of the hair. This way it's tucking the color right onto the skin, and that's ensuring that we get the depth that we're looking for to really enhance the shape. Once I find the shape that I'm looking for, then I can start applying the color through the hairs in the motion that the hairs are growing. Working my way towards the head of the brow, I'm also going to use short strokes so that we mimic brow hairs and the shadow that the brows cast on the skin. And I'm looking for more of the same level of the bottom edge of the brow so that it's a straighter shape and has less of a curve to the body of the brow. The wonderful thing about perfectly defined long wear brow pencil is that it has a spoolie on the opposite end. So once you've placed color, you can lift the color from the skin so that you get that three-dimensional quality in the brow and it doesn't look flat. Now that we've gotten the definition that we're looking for, you can see a big difference from one eyebrow to the other. But I want to set this eyebrow in place and make sure that her hair stay in place so that we keep that shape. To do that, I'm going to use the waterproof brow shaper and just comb it through making sure that I'm grooming the hairs right into the direction that I want them to stay in. And this is also waterproofing her brow so that if Alyssa gets stuck in the rain, she knows she has her eyebrows on. She's going to have them on all day. So there you have it. We've evened out Alyssa's brows using the perfectly defined long wear brow pencil and the waterproof brow shaper. She has brows that are going to last her all day.